All right, thanks, Jason. We've got some breaking news coming into Fox 10 News right now regarding a chase near DIP. Our Lee Peck is live on the scene. Want to go to him? What you're learning, Lee? Tell us what you've been able to find out so far. Well, from what we understand, Lanise, uh, there was some sort of pursuit. Uh, it ended here on DIP at Senator Street. You can see Mobile Police uh, in the distance over there. That is one of several units in this area. It's unclear uh, what prompted them to start this chase, but I can tell you when we were doing our live shot just a minute ago uh, outside MPD headquarters, we saw uh, an officer kind of take off really fast from the Waterburger directly across the street, likely coming to this chase. Again, it ended here. We're told about three or four people possibly bailed out of the vehicle. Uh, it's still unclear if anyone is in custody, but I can tell you just moments ago, uh, we got video of at least five or six officers uh, heading across the street into that carport over there. The lights were off at the time. They were screaming, MPD, MPD, come out, come out with your hands up. Uh, the light they turned on, they searched the uh, the garage area, came back out empty handed. We did not see them take anyone into custody. Uh, again, they are looking for at least at least three or four people again after a chase that ended here on Dolphin Island Parkway at Senator Street. Again, we do not know what prompted the chase. A lot of people have kind of been coming up not only on foot, but passing by asking us if we knew what happened. We do not know at this time, but we definitely want to give people uh, who maybe live in this area a heads up what is going on. There is a lot of uh, mobile police officers in this area trying to track down these suspects. We're going to continue to, to try to get the answers that we are, we're looking for. And uh, as soon as we get that information, we'll of course pass it along to you on air and online. Reporting live from DIP, Lee Peck, Fox 10 News.